Sa Emma Bishop Okonkwo speaks. Ghana Babylonia with 80 fast moving product. Sa Emma Bishop Okonkwo, a renowned businessman from Anambra State. This man alone owns many franchises in Nigeria's beverage and grocery industry, starting from Goya Olive Oil. He is the chairman of the Ecolo Group of Companies, which employs over 500 workers. A self-made man, likened to the proverbial king, meters who anything he touches turns to gold. Saima Bishop Ogonko incorporated his company, Ecolo International Limited, within the head office of Isale Be'aegbe on with the head office then on 30 Isala at Bede Street, Lagos, on July 3rd, 1984. The business has today metamorphosed into an oak tree. Initially into trading, they have since diversified into manufacturing and more. Now, a group of companies with Ecolo International Limited price destruction as Nigeria Limited, Ecolo Industries Limited, Advanced Industry Limited and Ecolo Pharmaceuticals Limited as subsidiaries. The man is worth billions of naira and is dubbed the richest able trader in Nigeria alive. Ima Bishop Okonkwa is the first is the franchise owner and manufacturer manufacturer of popular brands like Everwine, Goya Oil, Adonko Beaters, Mayonnaise, Titus Sardine, Ever Soup, Extra Virgin Olive Oil, Baron Devils Wine, Don Simon Drink. Medito soup, Moet, Hawaii soup, among others. All his products are making waves in the market. You know, I don't know. If I tell you, I know. I don't know. I know even get. I know get a. What's it called? I don't even get clue. Wow. Turu turu, anything where the man touch turn to gold. Sincerely, I am saying this. I need to wear this man touch. No, you don't need to see. Wow. This one, a real business done. I was like, I was not so see. The thing is, this is exactly how it is supposed to be. I'm telling you. This is exactly how it is supposed to be. That means this man follow for people we be say in businesses don't grow to the extent we be say in the employ people. Only this thing, only one particular company, not many people they employ. This person is supposed to refer to him as person will be one of the employers. Wow. I never knew sincerely. I oh, I honestly never knew that there was somebody who was not selling the normal cement, you know, Dangote's product. I never knew. This is really, his CV is actually very impressive. Sincerely, very. Huh. To crown all, he is a philanthropist. Ekulu, you will live long. Normal, normal. Anytime as you see an individual like this, he is always a philanthropist. In fact, we don't find it uh, what's it called? You will find it odd for them not to be. <laughs> Senior brother, from my childhood up till now, you're benefiting from your wealth. Indeed, you're a king of Ichi to your brethren and humanity. Long live you, brother. Chief Dr. Ima Bishop Okonkwo, OFR, is, of, is all this and much more in the business world. He is also a philanthropist extraordinaire. Touching so many lives and bringing so much development through his Emma Bishop Okonko Foundation, EBOF, he is indeed an institution. I love the fact that people are speaking well about him. God bless you, sir. More blessings to your wealth and more wind promotion awards and countless achievements ahead of you. You see, I think I love this. Anybody that did this, you try to be very sincere. Mm. Why I'm saying this is, we don't get to celebrate people enough while they're still alive. The people who are not really celebrated until they breathe their last. 
and it is very wrong. This is me saying whoever came up with this idea, maybe to give him a shout out, maybe to, you know, you know, remind him that, you know, Udugu, you did try. Udugu, you did try. See, this is a great idea. Like I repeat, we don't, we don't give enough. We don't give enough accolades to those who we think make our lives, even if it is 1% better. Sincerely. We are supposed to be saying it. The person is supposed to feel the love. It is not when the person has passed. You understand me? I'm telling you, we're supposed to open our mouth, expressing gratitude to these people every day. I mean, the person must not be this rich. The person you might even want to even talk about might not be even this wealthy. You might not have industries or companies. Might not be a producer or a manufacturer. Might not be even be this renowned businessman. The person might even be just your next door neighbor who anytime you're in need comes through for you even when he or she is struggling to stay afloat in life. That person comes through for you. He's always ready to calm you down, to give you advice, your shoulder to cry on. My dear, hold that person tight. You are not plenty again for this life in a world filled with coldness. You tell people about your problem and they're like, uh -huh. you think saying only you did suffer with of my own. If I tell you my own, you will believe me. I say make you forget your own. Yes. In a world where we are actually not, you know, we don't, we don't do much for, how am I going to put it? They're good people, but <laughs> they are rare. This is good. You don't get to talk about the living elephant until they die. That's what I'm talking about. So this should be a reminder today. If there's anybody around you, that person does so much for you. You feel this person is doing so, so much for you. This person is giving you enough love, showing you love, showing you care in the midst of his own difficulties. I beg, what other person is? Your brother, your sister, your mother, your father, your uncle, your aunt, please. Make that person feel appreciated. Appreciate that person. You might just draft a wonderful text message. If it's a voice note, the person listen to voice notes, you might just tell the person, oh, see you. Thank you. you have do, do you understand? I keep saying it. We don't get to do these things enough. Africans in general, we are taught to bottle up our feelings about people. It is high time we start celebrating people. As in what they call celebration of life. The person does not need to pass away. We thank the person. It is going to make the world a better place. Alright, and this note you've come to the end of the news. So thank you for telling me to listen until I come your way next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.